Quant touch, in other words, boosts the result. I was very young at that time, I was wondering why does he have a problem with his stomach because he's treating something else. I was kind of surprised there's no this kind of things with Quant touch. There is a fourth question people ask me, very common one. When people come to me asking for sessions, they ask There are three very common questions people ask me regarding quantum touch. The first one is if there is any side effect and the answer is no. And this makes me think about a situation when I was in the university. I had a colleague, he had something with his knee, something was going on there. He was taking medicine, very strong medicine. And then he had to treat his stomach because this was affecting his stomach. The medicine is so strong that he had a gastritis in his stomach. I was very young at that time, I was wondering why does he have a problem with his stomach because he's treating something else. I was kind of surprised. So with quantum touch, if you have a headache, if you have something happening with your bones and you know, take medicine, this is not going to affect your stomach. There is no this kind of things with quantum touch. So there is no side effect. The second question people ask me if a quantum touch session can interfere another treatment. And the answer is no. I remember a situation when I was running energy to someone in a treatment and when she came back to the doctor, the doctor was really surprised with the result, saying that the person's body responded very well to the treatment. He said this was not typical. Richard Gordon says that whenever you are running energy and someone you are combining different techniques energy healing techniques or even the mainstream treatments we all know the result is good quantum touch in other words boosts the result and i can see this very clear and the third question is during the session the people ask what should i do now and the answer is really simple don't do anything you just need to sit down be in a comfortable position, close the eyes and be receptive. I always ask people to be receptive because some people more sensitive, they can perceive the energy approaching, they can perceive the energy on the body, surrounding the body or even inside and working. This energy, life force energy working by itself according to our intention during the session. And some people, if they lay down, they can sleep. This is something that can happen, so I ask people to just sit down, close the eyes and relax. There is a fourth question people ask me, very common one. When people come to me asking for sessions, they ask how to learn quantum touch. Regarding this, there is a video, I'll put the link on the description of this video, about five ways to learn quantum touch. There are these five ways, but I would like to mention just one here. You can learn with Richard Gordon, in a video he recorded, the original workshop he recorded in an occasion when he was in a workshop teaching people. It's approximately five hours of video with a bonus. The link for this workshop is also in the description of this video. So these are the three very common questions people ask me. Is there any side effect when you are in a quantum touch session? Second question, does it interfere in another treatment? And third question, what do I do at the time of the session? These are the questions people ask me. And if you have any other questions, I'll be very happy to answer them. Please send me an email. See you in the next video.